Hey, what's up you amazing hackers? Hope you're all doing well today. So I'd like to show you guys an open redirect bypass that I found on bugbountyhunter.com. Bug Bounty Hunter is a great platform to teach you guys about bug bounty hunting and it has Sean's methodology on it for free. So definitely recommend you go check that out. Links will be in the description below. Uh, in this challenge, as you can see, we are only allowed to redirect to bugbountyhunter.com now. Quick inspection of the page already shows me that I have a link in here with an identifier. So um, doesn't take a genius to know that I can add this specific parameter to my URL, or at least I can try that. Um, and I can only redirect to bugbountyhunter.com, it says. So what I've tried is I've tried to paste in a URL fragment right here. But that doesn't work because those URL fragments, for you who do not know, these are treated client side, they're never sent to the server. So if I do this, server should ignore it. But in this case, it's not. There's definitely a filter going on right here. So I have to find a way to bypass it. And the really cool trick that Sean found right here is you guys can see the attack string a little bit already. Percent %E3, percent %80, percent %82 and percent %23. And if I URL decode that, what do you get? You get this strange dot, a space, and then the hashtag again to indicate URL fragment. So what do you guys think will happen if I paste this strange dot, for example, www.strange.google.com. Wow, look at that, guys. That actually resolves. So if you guys can follow the logic here we're going to apply the same thing over here it's this strange period that we're actually applying and if we do that it actually bypasses the filter in our case and redirects to the evil website so that's a really great bypass it really awesome um i personally wouldn't have come up with this this is really great um but if you can see uh, it doesn't always have to be easy. You just have to sometimes look for things that might look like other things. And, and now that you know these tricks, I, I'm sure you will be looking for them and using them in your day to day bug bounty hunting slash pen testing. It's just a matter of knowing, oh, this is also seen as a period. That's a great little trick you have there. Neat little party trick. Really awesome. Thank you so much, Sean, for this amazing lab. I hope you're doing well and I hope the family's doing well as well. Bye, amazing hackers.